In this video, we will be talking about materials in a tree structure. A tree's trunk has several layers, each having a specific function. The first structure of a tree's trunk I would like to point out is the outer bark of the tree. The outer bark is the outermost layer which protects the inside. It is mostly dead tissue. Just within the outer bark is what we call the inner bark. Inner bark contains a vascular tissue that we call phloem. Phloem is responsible for transporting and distributing nutrients to the plant. Working our way inward from the phloem is a thin layer called the vascular cambium. The vascular cambium is responsible for separating the phloem and the xylem. Xylem is another vascular tissue which is responsible for the transport of water and dissolved minerals to the roots. This is involved with secondary growth of the tree, which is an increase in the girth and wideness. Lastly, xylem can be separated into two major categories, sapwood and heartwood. Sapwood is the younger outer living wood of the tree. All wood formed in a tree begins as sapwood, which continues to draw water up from the roots. Heartwood is the innermost central layer. Its function is to support the tree, and it is made of dead cells which do not transport water or nutrients. You can often tell sapwood and heartwood apart. Sapwood is lighter in color, whereas heartwood is darker. Thanks for watching my video on materials and tree structure. I hope it helped you understand a tree's several layers and their functions.